What's up everyone, this is Cybernight, and today I'm going to open up a Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds Turbo Warrior 10 for you guys. So yeah, this is one of the older Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds 10s, and it's just an older 10 general because it actually has a little window in it, which is something I actually miss from these 10s. I don't know, it's, it's just something that just it looks cool. So you actually have Turbo Warrior right there in that little window, have like the artwork of it, and I forget what year. Oh yeah, it's 2008. Wow, I guess it's been at least 10 years on that too, because I think these came out around November or something. So yeah, that's that's weird. I remember whenever this tin first came out, so now I'm feeling a little bit old. But yeah, I got one of these tins, and I'm hoping that uh, we have some good luck with it. I mean, you guys love Yu-Gi-Oh! 5D's openings, as do I. I mean, it's like one of the best series of the show. So uh, let's go ahead and get to this. But real quick, before we do, I have sort of an announcement kind of thing, uh, because I have actually made Cyber Knight Field Centers, and I wanted to show you guys what they look like. I'm going to have these on eBay for now until I like set up my own store. But basically, these are the Cyber Knight Field Centers. I think they look really cool. They're pretty high quality. I mean, it seems like it's a little bit thicker than a Yu-Gi-Oh card. And yeah, I mean, I just thought I would have these in an eBay store for now. And again, if I can set up my own store, if I can figure it out, I would like to do that. But I'll have a link down in the description if you guys want to buy one of these. We also have Cyber Knight Dice, or I guess this one's a die. And it has, uh, of course, my logo on it. It says Cyber Knight. I'm hoping the camera picks this up. And even, yes, Cyber Knight 8610. I thought I would include that on this, this kind of limited run thing, and uh, these look really cool. So these will also be uh, in an eBay store, and uh, I think it looks really awesome. I like the color of this one, and uh, again, I kind of like having the 8610, but like I said, that'll be like a limited time thing, and they'll probably come up with a different design, and it could even be that way at Field Centers. I'm not really sure yet, but I thought these would be kind of cool because I know you guys have asked for different kind of Cybernet merchandise, and especially Field Centers, so I try to make you know high-quality stuff on both of those that was as cheap as I could get them and we can probably do more stuff in the future too like I said different designs and, and all that so links to both will be down in the description and I also too want to say thank you to everyone that watches my videos I mean my views have been doing great you guys have been liking the videos so I really appreciate that and I'm just trying to um do what you guys want me to do basically you want to see an opening I'm really trying to get to it and uh you know anything so I, I can't thank you guys enough. It's been an awesome year so far, and uh, let's let's see if we can continue that, right? Like, sincerely, thank you. I'm trying to open this up while I'm talking about it, too, because I don't want to waste your time. <laughs> I, I hate making a little bit of time to show you guys those other things, but, yeah, I, I think they look cool. So we had to make a little bit of time, but I don't like self-promoting too much. <laughs> but anyway, we have Turbo Warrior for our promo. That is the only promo you get from this, by the way. It, it's the older tins, so you got one promo card. You didn't get, like, a promo pack and all that, like we see nowadays. Even with the Mega Tins, we see that. And this tin has a good variety, too, because you're getting two of Crosswords of Chaos. These are actually first edition packs, which is tough to find. One of Duelist Genesis, one of Light of Destruction, yeah, <laughs> and also Phantom Darkness. Then you do also, though, get these tokens. It's not really a promo pack, but uh, it was a cool thing, so I like them. That's why I don't really count it as a promo pack, but it's still neat. By the way, this is like a what was it, like a coupon to get, yeah, free admission to a tournament, yeah, that happened in 2009, so, <laughs> I, I think we're a little late, and yeah, you have like a double dude token, a grinder golem, and then also a sky blaster, I believe, so, these were kind of cool, they had several different ones, I forget how many, but, uh, yeah, <laughs> can't go wrong with that, again, I like it when, uh, they try something a little different, anyway, let's go through a pack, so I guess we'll go oldest to newest on this, right, Phantom Darkness, None of these you're guaranteed a hollow, either. Cyber Ouroboros. That one looks cool. <laughs> what else we got here? Sea Koala. And uh, we have Cry Havoc. So that one's pretty cool. It's a rare. And one of the Destiny heroes. Unfortunately, no you bell forms. <laughs> That's what I always hope for from those. Then, of course, uh, Light of Destruction. I remember going to this sneak preview, too. That's been a while. That's another one that's been uh, quite a long time. All right. Cup of Ace. Raging Cloudian. Arcana Force. Oh, do we have something? Yeah, we got an Ultra Rare. Okay. I thought I could tell because it was a little bit darker on the edge. We did, though. We got Super Ancient a Dino Beast. Well, that's pretty awesome. I remember being really happy about this card, too, because it was actually dinosaur support. We did not see that uh, very often in Yu-Gi-Oh! Of course, this is way before that, I think, was it before even the original structure deck? It might have been. 
I don't know exactly, but we just did not see support for dinosaurs for forever. So uh, this was kind of a big deal. And I remember trying to get this card back then too. That is awesome. Also, I like how he has like little wings. <laughs> He's like this giant dinosaur little wings. Okay, yeah, that'll work. <laughs> but yeah, that is awesome. We got an ultra rare. Unifrog. Rainbow Gravity as well. That's a good start. And now the Duelist Genesis. Since these are 5Ds, I believe this is, you're always getting a rare, but you can also get a hollow. So, they changed that in 5Ds, and then later on, Arc 5, that's when we start getting hollow per pack. In case people are confused on that. Yeah. Alright, whoa, there we go. Okay, um, Medium Peace Golem. Tricky Spell 4. Turbo Booster. And? Yeah, we did! We got another hollow! Uh, Sinister Sprocket. Well, there we go. That's uh, one of the original Tuner Monsters as well. This is, you know, the set that gave us Synchro Summoning and Tuner Monsters and all that, too. So that's pretty cool. I remember trying to get this one as well. I was trying to get, like, every Tuner Monster and Synchro I could back then. I think that's what everyone was doing. And then also uh, Fighting Spirit. So, yeah, we also got a rare. That's pretty cool. I mean, I'm just happy we're actually getting a few hollows. So you never know with older packs. You can get all rares so easy <laughs> that uh, you just never know. All right, now, Crossroads of Chaos. I'm really hoping for something good because first edition packs of Crossroads are really tough to get. I don't think you can get a box that's first edition, honestly. So, let's see. Let's go for that Ghost Black Rose. What am I saying? That's, <laughs> that's what I should go for. The Hunt is back on. Okay. Revival Gift. And? Oh, we have a Mosaic Manticore. Eh, kind of cool. I always like this card just because it looks neat. <laughs> And one of the Iron Chains, Iron Chain Snake, Jade Knight, and Gadget Hauler. Unfortunately, just work. Well, don't run away. <laughs> and then, last pack. Okay, what are we ending with? Can we with a hollow? I need like all of that power right now. I want in with a hollow on this. Let's see what we can get. Heart of the Cards, help me out. Hitting that like button helps me out. <laughs> Again, that, that might be a trap. I don't know. <laughs> We'll see. Seed of Deception. There you go. Nettles. And Boost Scrap. And is this? Yeah, we did. We ended with a hollow. See, I told you guys, it always works. <laughs> that is awesome, though. We got Botanical Lion, which back in the day was actually a pretty decent card. It was, again, kind of that time where we never saw plant support until Crossroads seemed like it finally gave us plant support. And this card was really good. I remember using it in one of the older video games. I know for sure because it was strong. It would get 300 attack points uh, for each plant type. So it counted itself. It'd be like 1,900 then. So, that is awesome. I'm glad I actually have a first edition. I don't think I've ever had a first edition of this card. And then also, uh, Polynosis. We also got a rare. Anything else? I'm trying to remember if there was any crazy comments. Not really on that. But I'm just happy we actually got a hollow. First edition, Crossroads. I'll take it. That is awesome. I would love to eventually, one of these days, if I get a bunch of those first edition packs, if I could try to get like a Ghost Rare from that, because I'd love a first edition Ghost Rare Black Rose. <laughs> that would, that'd be amazing because they're so rare. But, uh, yeah, I <laughs> hope you guys have enjoyed this opening. As always, thank you guys for watching. Uh, again, thank you for all the support you guys have been showing me. Like, seriously, the videos are doing great. And I'm glad I'm able to do things now like field centers and all that kind of stuff, too. And I'm working on so many projects lately. Like, seriously, I want to try to do live streaming. If my internet can do it. I live in the middle of nowhere, so my internet sucks. <laughs> so I'm trying to find a way to make that work, maybe live openings and stuff too. And I just want you guys to know I'm always looking to improve this channel. With your help, I mean, seriously, we can do that. And I really appreciate it when you guys hit that like button and subscribe and all that too. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great day. Also, just let me know if there's any other openings you guys would like to see in the future. And of course I will. Catch you guys later. See ya.